morning, good afternoon, good evening guys wherever you are on this beautiful world Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers My name is Didi and yes, Bitcoin is a revolution from my back home garden in Playa de Carmen Still here, not too long anymore but I will tell you more about that in the new video Let's quickly jump into a beautiful TA video with like 4 amazing charts That will show you exactly what I think and feel about Bitcoin Let's jump here okay. This is the first one guys, this is the 4 hour chart, my face is now in the right top, maybe I don't need to shift it that much in this way, <coughs> let's see if that works, um, on this 4 hour chart guys, you can see that the bam bam um, called the long over here, we would have taken it over there where there is complete green in the bottom, um, we would have taken this profit of course from there to the short flag, um, that would be like a 7% profit. You can see that this <coughs> Bollinger band on the back, this blue band, is like getting lesser wide and mostly with the width is, is decreasing. And mostly when that happens, like uh, for example over here, look, it decreased and became very small, then bam, we have a breakout. Um, the time before, uh, we became very small, bam, we went up. So uh, we are seeing this happening again. We are seeing this tightening of the Bollinger Band with mostly means that we will see a breakout soon, guys. How is the <coughs> chart doing over here? This one, let's see the daily. That's kind of looking okay. Yeah, We had a low over here, we have a higher low over there. We, we want to see the higher low above this purple line. And the beautiful part on the daily chart is that we can see the RSI is breaking out. So um, look, every time when the RSI breaks out, bam, we see this huge run. When the RSI is breaking out over here now, maybe retesting it and then running, then we can see the real run. Normally it breaks out directly to the top, but this is a daily chart and this candle still needs to close. So let's see what this is going to do. Um, in this <coughs> chart here over there, it's also the daily chart. You can see it a little bit more closely that this dotted line in the back and the bottom of the RSI, we need to break that. We are kind of breaking that depending on how we draw it. If we draw it like this, the, the top here is in, <coughs> then we are breaking it at the moment. We can see also the price line down, coming down. We need to break that as well. And then we will uh, go for that uh, green line first, 33, and then the red line, of course, 48. But the resistance here is the first yellow line. That first yellow line at 38K, that is the resistance. That is the one that we need to break. Now, maybe we will break it and then break the green line at the same time over there. On the weekly, we are zooming out, there is a long flag on the short, so that is what you do when you get the bam bam indicator, you get these alerts that tell you when to long on the 15, on the 5, on the 30 minute, just whenever you uh, program them. <coughs> on this um, weekly chart, I just wanted to show you um, how much profit you could have made with the bam bam indicator on the weekly let's say you started with 100k that's like 9 btc over here on the 12th october then here you would have sold and those 9 btc would have turned into 495,000 US dollar you would have bought back over here but you would have bought back in total 14.5 btc at 34k and you would have sold again at 63k there was 45.55 BTC and it was 917,000 US dollars. And you would be buying back soon when we seen that long flag. And then you would be buying for almost a million dollars depending on the Bitcoin price. But I guess it could be around 20 Bitcoins that you're buying back for that next run up. That is how easy the Bam Bam indicator works if you tie an amount to it, guys. Now on the monthly, <coughs> we can see exactly the same. Um, this one is going to close, this is a very well important close, uh, this one is going to close in like 10 hours. So this candle in 10 hours, I think it's very good when it closes above that blue line. The blue line, let me be clear, is a 21 moving average. The blue line is the, uh, look, end of input, it's a 21 <coughs> moving average of the monthly. This has also in history been proven to be a very important support line. The moment we break that line, you can see over here, the bear market started. Also when we break that orange line, 
very important moment. We did already break it, but we are finding support now on that next level of support, and that is the 21 moving average. Important, in my opinion, RSI is not at the bottom yet, but it is uh, kind of low. If you look back, every time when we came to that green line, we exploded up again. So let's see in the monthly how they will play out do i have any more charts yes i have any more charts hope my face is still in the right place in the top over there and we will jump into bam over here this is the first one ah now i need to switch my face you see <clears throat> this is really cool because if you look at this chart you can see very clearly that um, the exchange net flow means that there is a lot of outflows from the exchanges so you can see that here on the bottom you can see the inflows and the outflows there is a lot of outflows from the exchanges and the price is going up. So what does that mean? That means that I think a lot of big whales started to buy Bitcoin and um, because they start to buy Bitcoin, they move the Bitcoins from the exchanges into their wallets. And yes, that will drive up the price like it always does. Look here, <coughs> the whales start to buy. That's this moment here, I will do it like this look what happened after it always also in the short term here we had a drop the will start to buy we went up and can we see this in another chart yes we can of course we can did on this chart i will make my face now a little bit smaller and on the bottom over here you can see that very clearly you can see very clearly the green line is going up like very steeply and the green line is representing the wills that are holding more than 1000 BTC. And when did they start to do that? Exactly when the gray line went down, when the price went down, like they always do. When the gray line is going down, you can see at a certain moment the green line will go up, and that means the wills start to accumulate Bitcoin, the price starts to go up. And when the wills accumulate more Bitcoin, the price will probably go up more and more. So let's see if this green accumulation line for the wheels means that we are now turning around and that Bitcoin is bam <coughs> found its bottom again around 34,000 US dollar this time. So maybe we will take it to that new all time high of 70 to 80k. I am really looking forward to that all time high from Mexico. I don't think I will see that one in Mexico, but then again, we are leaving very soon. Um, but then I will keep them a surprise. Uh, I hope you really enjoyed today's TA video. If you did enjoy the TA video and drinking your coffee, well, hmm, then please give the video a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment as I love to respond to your comments. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again. And yes, maybe I will do a walk a talk video later today as well. So tomorrow we will have some more food for thought.